What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a back to school get ready with me. You know, like for the first day of school for like high school students. That'd be cute and relevant and fun to do a little back to school get ready with me. So I'm going to do my hair, my makeup so I don't look so like busted. And yeah, I'll show you guys how I would get ready for school. So if you like that, keep on watching. Be sure to give me a thumbs up. Show me how much you like this. Subscribe to me to show you how much you like me. Click that little bell to turn on my post notifications so you can see when I post every single Tuesday. I post a lot about like lifestyle. Um, I want to do some like art stuff because I like I paint. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about me. Let me know what you want me to film. Let me know what you think about this video. And yeah, so. Thank you so much. Last time I did a get ready with me, I did kind of like a voiceover type deal, but today I kind of want to just talk through it rather than that. So I have had my hair in a bun all day. Um, it's pretty freshly washed. I showered last night. And so personally, I hated school. By the way, I'm using the, the 360 spray bottle that has like... I don't know, if you watch my vlog, I literally talked all about it. And if you want to, I'll put it in like a little card right here. That, um, click up and watch my vlog, because I thought it was really funny. Um, and I really enjoyed filming it. And I really enjoyed editing it and all of that, so if you want to watch that, be sure to do that. Um, so what was I saying? I didn't love high school. I had friends, I guess, but it just wasn't for me. I hope that college is better, but one of my first like tips, I guess, would be like, don't try so hard. Like if you are like an, a naturally extra person, then don't listen to this. But like, like you don't need all of the makeup and all that stuff because honestly who even cares about the people that you see at school they honest unless they're your friends or like your boyfriend or something they suck and you shouldn't care about them so like don't try too hard but enough so where you feel like good about yourself like I remember like going through days of school and like just feeling like crap and like hating myself and that's never fun so just like make yourself look good enough for you <laughs> if that makes any sense probably doesn't okay so I have like <laughs> my hair is like in so I'm using Miss Jessie's multicultural curls I really like is it focusing whatever I really like this stuff however it's just not enough hold for me so I can't just use this. So I just brush the product through. Give myself. Someone's calling me. I love, I freaking love Five Guys. Like, that's my guilty pleasure. I don't eat a lot of fast food, but mm, Five Guys really gets it. Oh, oh my god. All right, I was gonna put you guys. Okay, first of all, this is my pet peeve about five guys though. Like, why is the normal size one called the little and like the double patty called normal? Like, that just really pisses me off. Like, that's why like Americans are fat, I feel like. Because we just like every like normal size things are like small. Like, oh, it just pisses me off. I don't know why it like heats me up so much. Also, another thing if your local fast food place has this, Vanilla orange high C is legitimately the best ever. Like, it tastes like a creamsicle. And like for some people that might be too sweet, but I legitimately have the biggest sweet tooth in the world. Oh, by the way, I'm adding Jelly Soft Curls by Miss Jessie's. I just have to do both because my hair is so curly. It just, that's the only way I can get enough hold with Miss Jessie's products. Like, they're not my favorite, but I ran out of my Jane Carter, so. I still like them. They like work. Just like Jane Carter is just mm, that bitch. Okay, so now I have this whole top half of my head and I'm just gonna spray the front of it. Just to kind of get it wet, obviously. 
And I'm gonna pull it back. Let's do it. Let's do it lower. Let's put a little lower. Ooh, that's cute. <laughs> and then I'm gonna take this blue scrunchie that I got from Urban Outfitters for too much money and put it over there. I feel like, all right, I don't know, is this just me? Or like, when you go into Urban Outfitters, you just feel like all of a sudden you're a boss ass bitch who can afford everything. And then you leave and you have no money. <laughs> now I'm gonna do my edges. I'm honestly so bad at doing my edges. So yeah. I'm gonna take the jelly soft curls and put a little bit on my finger. And like if someone can direct me to like a good edge tutorial, then like please do. Oh see that looks so bad. I think I'm like taking up too So then I try to do it just for two minutes and then I just brush them all back. Just nice and clean. Like I don't go out of the house looking crazy. Like I at least clean them up. Ew. So I just put a little bit of gel here and then I take a toothbrush and then I just kind of brush it back. Just a little bit. See so just to like so I don't look crusty dusty. Oh, there's a baby crying outside my window. I wonder why they're crying. I bet they fell. My, like, mom instincts kick in. Like, I just want to take care of them. Okay. It's like so well. So, now we're out of focus. So, the hair portion is done. It kind of looks like crap. But honestly, I kind of like it. Alright, I'm gonna pose like James Charles. So now I'm gonna do my makeup. So here's the thing, here's about English is my first language. So here's the thing about like me and my makeup. We have a very special relationship. I'm not gonna wear a lot of like face stuff, so fucking sue me. All right, so I'm gonna start with like concealing my under eyes and then just like kind of any red spots that I have, just kind of covering those up. I also have a weird relationship with concealer. I use the Tarte Shape Tape, but this one's a little too light for me right now because it's summer. So I'm going to fucking sue me if you want to, but I'm going to put some of it on the back of my hand. That is so light. And then I'm going to mix it with this foundation. I don't know if that's against the law, but fucking, what am I doing? Oh, that's way dark. It's just hard to tell. Two drops of that one. Don't get it tested. And then I'm taking this, this like makeup eyeshadow brush because I like the way a brush works better with concealer. Don't fucking talk to me if you don't like that. So I'm just gonna go under my eyes with this brush. Just like that. That was too much. I just wanted a little, and then just over like the white spot, the red spot. It's a little on my chin, I guess. I don't know. I forgot to put on moisturizer. So I'm gonna put on moisturizer now. On the spots that I didn't put it, I just used Cetaphil. That was too much. I use Cetaphil because it's the best and it's just pretty basic. Like, it doesn't have like any added shit. You know what I'm saying? It's just your basic. Thing. And I'm honestly going to use a beauty blender to blend my moisturizer because I'm a beauty guru. Okay, so I'm just going to blend it in. Probably going to forget to take this off tonight. That's also why I have a horrible relationship with makeup because I just forget to take it off because why would I remember? I barely remember to feed myself. And I watch so many like like makeup tutorials, ugh, but I just don't do it anymore because it's just so much work. And then like my queen Tana Mojo, I also get anxious and I'm going to blend that in. Oh my god, I should start telling story times. I have a lot of good stories, but I just get anxious 
to share them because I, I don't know. All right. Now I'm gonna go into my eyes. I'm gonna take the leftover um, stuff on this eyeshadow thing and just kind of prime my eyes really quick. I haven't done my makeup in eons. I don't know what that means. Ages. I'm doing this so wrong, but I think that doesn't look bad for a makeupless queen. Um, I'm actually going in with the yellow. <laughs> I'm just gonna put that all over my eye, honestly, because I just love yellow. I'm using the the Zulu by Juvia's. I don't know this palette. It's so effing pretty i'm like obsessed with it and i rarely wear makeup but okay no i don't even i barely wear makeup but when i do i always use this palette i always use this palette. it's so pretty and like look at that pigment like it's so hard to get yellows to to show but like might focus okay queen look at that yellow i'm gonna go with that orange oh. I'm gonna put it right underneath. Oh my god, we're gonna look so pretty. I'm so, I, I wasn't excited for the makeup portion and now I am because I honestly forgot all this. I'm just gonna put more into it there. And that's it, like, I don't know, I like really basic looks and I kinda just wanna do this pinky color. Is that gonna look stupid? No, it's gonna look bomb. We're gonna look so cute on our first day of school that I'm not doing. I think this is so pretty, and I don't care if you don't, because I do. And I like this Tartiste lash paint. It comes out so weird, though. You know how it's usually like a twist? It just comes out like that, and it always is this long squiggly, so I just kind of brush that off. Alright, and then I just put on mascara. Lately, I've been doing fake lashes, but... Oh, my God. Doesn't that seem like a hassle on the first day of school? I don't have the motivation to do fake lashes on the first day. Oh my god, imagine if like, I became famous because I said something offensive. That'd be like, if I was the opposite of Laura Lee. I should start saying offensive things. I don't know. I've been all up into like, the Laura Lee, Manny MUA, fucking Jeffree Star, scandals, and let me tell you like, Bro, I'm a Jeffree Star stan. Like, I love everything he's about. Like, I love everything, like, uh, where he's come after what he's been through. Like, oh my god, like, how, bro? How? And right, then I do my lower lashes. I can't talk. Ew, these look clumpy. Whatever, I don't care. I'm, like, so anal about clumpy lashes. Like, I feel like this is clumpy. This is the Physician's Formula Butter Highlighter. My boyfriend got this for me because he's the sweetest. You know how people like mix like highlighter with like baby oil and like rubbed them on their bodies? He made that for me. He like, it's not sweet because he knows I'm like, I'm not like a makeup less queen. Like I'm not like anti makeup. I'm not like whatever. But, like, he knows I don't wear a lot of makeup. And he just did that shit for me, like, because, you know, I, I do, like, a little glow. Like, I'm so pretty girly. Like, I'm not, like, a girly girl. I wouldn't call myself, like, she's a girly girl. But, like, I would call myself not girly. I like sparkle. And I like pink. That's my favorite color. I'm going to just do, like, a brown lipstick covered with this gloss so this lipstick is called matte i don't know if it's called matte 1993 or if it's like 1993 matte but it's a lipstick and it's called 1993 and it's urban decay and i have had this forever i don't know how long you're supposed to keep lipsticks for that's disgusting um i start off with like a chapstick of sorts i like this like Burt's bees overnight treatment i mean it's not nighttime and if you're watching this, you're about to go to school. But, whatever. So, I take that and I put it on all over. Just 
Just let it really moisturize. And then I put this on top of it, like right on top. I don't know if I'm supposed to do that or not. I like zoom in right on my lips. Aren't those little flushes? Yo, I have such big nostrils. If I got hate, like if I was relevant, relevant enough to get hate, everyone would say how big my nostrils are. I actually had a girl hate me. Should I even put this online? I don't know. But I am. I had a girl hate me. And like she called me Nostril Naomi. I think that's so funny. I thought it was so funny. That really just cracks me up. On top of it, I'm going to put this sexy mother pucker extreme plumper by soap and glory i love this lip gloss like can't you see like i'm almost out of it there we go oh my god all right and i got all over my lips because i love a glossy lip let me just suppose this Okay, so I like put my hair up in a bun because I hate when my hair is down. It was just getting my face and it didn't even look good. So I just took it down. But I added these hoops that I got. Ugh, I added these hoops that I got from Urban Outfitters. They're like these super thin like gold hoops. I love them. They're super cute. Like, like, mm, that's a look. And then this also goes. Dude, I can't even afford it, but I don't even know why I buy their clothes. But then I got this, like, striped long sleeve tee that I got in the men's section, but it's super cute. Also got it at Urban. But I'm just wearing these, like, I got these, like, yoga pants that I'm wearing that are, like, sporty yoga pants, even though I don't have sports. And I got these at Target for, like, $30. Oh, yeah, and this shirt was... 38 and these earrings were 20. I'm wearing the little scrunchie because I always wear scrunchies on my arm. I don't know, I just think it's cute. And then I'm wearing my like white Birkenstocks that I got from like the Birkenstocks website. They were like a hundred or so. That is it. Thank you so much for watching my little transformation from like busted to somewhat less busted um if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up give me a thumbs up um subscribe to my channel turn on the post notifications i post every single tuesday leave a comment letting me know what you want to see next i kind of want to do another back to school video because it's that time of year and if you're going back to school or you're starting a new school or you're starting off a new chapter of your life just fucking do it with a good attitude like I feel like that's what changes everything honestly I talked about how my high school experience was shit because I didn't go into it with a good attitude but college is a new place I'm gonna go into it with a smile on my face and I think that'll make it all the way all the more better I don't know that didn't make sense but like just go into it with a good attitude make friends that you didn't think you would make before I know it sounds corny but like your best friend could be someone that you never thought you'd even talk to so yeah um good luck to everyone starting this new chapter of your life and i will see you next tuesday thank you so much for watching